Hello and welcome to the Minimalist Art Club. This is a game that I saw on Game Jolt, and uh, it's a bit strange, the controls at least. And uh, I... There's no way I can see to lower, like, mouse sensitivity. The computer is open to an art gallery club page. Seems like it could be interesting. You start to fill out the form. Uh... Let's do that. Your name is never named? This is correct, sure. Looks like the club starts in an hour. Might as well head over now. There are some loading screen tips that are so obscenely fast. You can't leave, you're here to join the art club. Figure in large hat, where are you? Ah, you, yes. Are you here for the minimalist art club? Well, get over here, we're about to start. <laughs> you casually walk over. Hey, you made it. I'm Jeff, third ranked member of the minimalist club. You can tell it's me by the small hat. Next is Lady Gofo- oh no, it's the same guy. Oh no, that's the guy in the large hat, that's the, that's Jeff, and this is Lady Gofungus. Next is Lady Gofungus. She's from one of the outer colony planets. I've been calling her Sue. Like my hat? It marks my rank of second of the minimalist club. Next is Sir Fartor, first ranked member of the minimalist club. That's not my full name, Jeffrey. Of course. Captain G Dr. Captain General Sir Fartor III, the second, named after his father, Sir Fartor III, first ranked member of the Minimalist Club. No wonder you have so much trouble getting paperwork done. It takes half the day just to sign your name. That is not important. We have a new member to greet. First things first, have a look at this painting. What does it mean? Uh, it's a duck. Well, yeah, I guess it's that too. It doesn't matter though. The artist should be arriving at about 50 minutes. Go find us some refreshments. I believe there's a- I've seen a fridge somewhere around here. You work here. What is this? It's my Minecraft OC. Oh, maybe this will tell me. This piece is labeled Mr. Tree. It's going to be shipped to another gallery on a distant planet soon. Press E to be mildly interested. I like the humor in this game. The mouse sensitivity is a bit all over the place. So, uh, I'm struggling against that. What is this? The screen is displaying the message, not an art display. There is a note on it that says 5D. This piece is labeled Passage. It's two lines. Is, is this loss? This piece is labeled Destination. It's a square, of, a square of stairs. A set of squares. This is circles. This piece is labeled Dots. It's three circles of descending size. Right. Um, there's no other controls. I have to move at this speed. Hey, guys. Hey, guys. How are you doing? You look gorgeous. You're gonna be my thumbnail. Yes, you are. So I, so, I wonder how you'll handle this club. It can be a bit strange. Why did you join the club? I worked here when the club start was started. I decided to join them. Back so soon? What do you need? Uh, why did you join the club? I saw a poster for it outside of a VR lounge. Thought it was cool, so I signed up. Why did you join the club? Join? I invented this club! Sure. It's a duck! Okay. Where are our refreshments? Okay, is this the kitchen? The section is a bunch of books on art design. Books on the shelf are about, are about properly placing books on shelves. Press E to wonder about the strange coincidence. These books are about cooking for aliens. The covers are weird. There's no- the books here are about how to be invisible. These books are not are about not panicking. They're all, press E to wonder where you left your towel. These are a bunch of books on the subject of where chinchillas. Press E to be mildly spooked. So this game is like sci-fi as well. It, it's a silly take on sci-fi. I wonder what's upstairs. I saw this game on Game Jolt and I just thought, you know what? I might as well play it. It looks interesting. Oh. Th they seem to instantly know where I am at all times, which is concerning. What's going on in this room? This looks interesting. Ooh, it's Madame Automata. This fortune-telling robot doesn't seem to be active. Do I press the purple pixel to activate them? What are you? Nothing. So this is the computer lounge, I guess? The computer is open to a page on hats and hat materials. They're kind of overpriced. Press E to not buy a hat. There's also a note. 4C. 5D 4C. Hmm, I wonder if this is going to be a note, like, C, D, if, if, 
four C means that four that C is the fourth letter or something, and five D means that D is the fifth letter or something, then that would imply that it's a letter. It's a word rather. It's kind of like you open the box and inside is a robot arm. How odd. The box is empty, so I actually did pick it up. Right. I wonder what I'm doing in the minimalist art club. There's no actual settings for mouse sensitivity or anything, so that's my my one problem with the game so far, is that I, it's kind of difficult to not flail around like a... Oh, do I need to give the arm to you? Sure, you don't look menacing at all. Okay, well, who are you? You place the arm back on the robot. The hand opens, dropping a key piece. The robot seems to be working fine. Can I talk to him? I don't like not being able to talk to robots. Robots are people too, you know. Alright, what's this? There's a file open in here. It says 8B. And now what's in this chest? I'm basically looting the art club. A set of tarot cards. Oh, I can give them to the fortune-telling robot then. What's through here? Oh, and now I'm back out here. Right. What's this? Oh, no, that's the refreshments machine. Right. Don't want to do that yet, because I want to, um... Actually, can I talk to them again? Hope they have some sodas. Yeah, when will the artist show up? I don't know. Soon, I think. I'm excited to meet him. I really want to know what it means. It's a duck. Back so soon? What's up? It's supposed to be soon. You never know, though. Could be a while. Soon, he just texted me about it. I will admit, this will be the first time I've met him. We're gonna find refreshments. How am I supposed to know that? Look around, they must be here somewhere. Harumft. Okay, now that I'm back in here, I can go up and look at the fortune-telling robot, I guess. I have to, would have to go on here again. Oh well, maybe, I probably need a coin or something to activate the machine. So, maybe the fortune-telling robot can give these to me? The robot springs to life and grabs the deck of cards. It sh slowly shuffles them and then speaks. How many times have you returned my cards? One. A piece of a key is deposited from a slot. I have two key pieces now. I can go and fight Mega Satan. Ha <laughs> ha. Isaac jokes. There's that door over there, but there's also more doors over that way that I haven't explored experimented in, or what with, or something along those lines. That I haven't viewed. This is the robot, just. This is just the robot, right? Yes. How does that door lead me out there? No, that, that actually does work. Sorry, I'm just stupid. I just... I'm having trouble remembering the layout. That's a mermaid. What are you? Computer is open to a page on fish tank repair. Pr pr press E to learn how to repair fish tanks. There's also a text file, 7A. Info, mermaid slash siren. This creature was found on Alexand 7th. Pictures are available on Tuesday for $10. Warning, this creature is a hybrid of a mermaid and a siren. Do not pass the ropes, do not approach the tank. Sirens are a class 3 hazard and should be treated as such. I'm gonna approach the mermaid. Photos are 10 bucks on Tuesday. It's not Tuesday, so no photos. You a mermaid? Yeah, haven't you ever seen one before? Came here from off world. Now I do pictures. What are you doing here? I get paid to sit in this tank and take pictures with tourists. Not exactly my dream job, but still, pays the bills. I don't know, but I do need something to distract me. This place is really boring. You're the first visitor I've had all day. Hopefully, I have been an ample distraction, my lady. Now, what's in the fridge? The fridge is currently locked, and the side has a small keypad. Doesn't look like it's going to open. You need the code. Yeah, it's like a... Fish tank repair 7A. C... So, it's... 7... Four, five, CD... CDA... Something? So maybe, like, CDAB, possibly. Possibly the code is CDAB. Because in alphabetical order, that should be it, right? Let 
me get into the fridge. Let me get into the fridge. Uh, C, uh, C D A B, right? Doesn't open. Looks like you need the code. But it's possibly um. If I'm going in or alphabetical order, it could be like um. I should write down codes. Why do I not write down codes? 8B, 5G, 4C, 7A. So, in order of alphabetical, it should be 7... Or A, B, C, D, right. 7, 8, 4, and 5. The fridge opens. Yeah, I'm smart. You grabbed a pack of sodas. The fridge is currently unlocked. There are some drinks inside it along with raw fish. Do you know about this? Okie dokie then. I'll be on my way and it's time to check the door at the end of the hallway then. Get down here, the artist is here. And here's our newest unranked member. A oh, cool soda. So what do y'all do here? We determine if art is minimalist. Yours has been showing up a lot. So we decided to check out your newest piece. But we do have a question if you wouldn't mind settling the debate. Sure, I guess I can help. What is the meaning of this piece? Press E to hear the dramatic reveal. It is a picture of a duck. What? But what about the anti-modernism? I don't know what that is. Does it have any other meaning? Other than just being a painting of a duck? No, not really. The owner of the gallery paid me 200 credits to paint this. Guess he's a fan of ducks. What about your other works? They have meaning, right? Sure, I guess, if you want them to. Well then, I'm not sure what to do now. Should I have told... Should I have told y'all it meant something? Kinda seems like I just ruined your club. No, we needed to know the truth. Well, this has been fun, but I'm starving. I'm gonna go get lunch. Y'all are welcome to join me. Be interesting to hear what y'all think. Yeah, I guess lunch could be nice. Sure, food sounds good. Fine, I'll join. I feel ridiculous for getting this hat for nothing. Oh, it's got planets on it, I only just realized. Is that a mouse on top of his hat? Press E to join everyone in getting lunch. And so, the 37th meeting of the Minimalist Club was a success. Kinda. I guess. Still was freaking ridiculous. Ah, oh, but what do you know? Created by that other guy. The other guy made with one game creator. Made for the Jammington's 5.0 Game Jam. Thanks to his playtesters. Didn't make music sounds. Etc. The game will restart. Alright, I'm gonna go through that again and just look at the door at the end of the hallway. Because I want to know what was in there. Alrighty, this door will not remain a mystery for long. The door is locked. There might be a key somewhere. Okay, so the key wasn't to do with the main mission at all. Okay, I'll go through and I'll get the key pieces, right? And then I'll meet you back at that door. Wait a second, I wonder, does this cap carry over between runs? Where and when were they returned? Here. I, re I returned... Uh, sure. I thought, I don't know, does it carry over between runs? I don't know. Because it asked two questions that time, I don't know. Anyway, back to the door. The door is locked, there might be a key somewhere. So I still don't have all the key pieces, right. So I'll explore around a bit more and see if I find anything. Wait a second. Oh, wait a second, there's another chest over there, right. Maybe. I can't jump in this game, so... I'm assuming that what I'm doing is this. Coming along here, and just hopping from light to light in a way that hopefully won't, you know, let me fall. Yikes, there we go. To the chest. In the box inside was a water was waterproof cell a waterproof cell phone. It's an older model, but still functioning. I can give that to the mermaid, probably. Because she's so bored. Ugh, she's so bored. I mean, you probably would be bored kept in a tank all day, but still. Worry not, my mermaid love. I'm coming for you, or something to that effect. I just want to know what's behind the door. Do you want this? Hey, throw me that phone. That kind is waterproof. I'll give you something for it. Received key piece one. Do I have all the pieces now? Wonder do if I do. I'll check the door. The door opens. You should go look at the computer. This is not part of the jam. For the jam part, choose secret ending one. For non-jam part, choose secret ending two. 
I chose secret ending one. I'll do that again if I need to. Okay. Sure. What's this? Oh, hey. You're with that club, aren't you? How'd you get in here? Um, why was there a waterproof phone? Either way, it's not important. I'm working on my newest painting. It's a set of cameras. It's a, it, I've got a set of cameras on that painting out there, so I can paint the club's member. Cool, right? Why? Because this is more fun exp than explaining that the painting is just a duck. I have no idea what they're rambling about. Hey, what do you think of the painting? I'm kind of interested. It's a duck. I know, right? The dude who commissioned it was really specific about the kind of duck, too. It was kind of weird, but I made 200 credits off it. Well, I need to take a break. I guess I should go out and talk to them. Or, how about we sneak into the mermaid room and drink sodas? The mermaid has a few good stories. Oh, secret ending. Yay! Time to go and get the second secret ending, then, because I am an obsessive completionist. I don't know what this machine did. The vending machine appears to be broken. It won't dispense sodas. View credits. The That's an ending for this game. Well, it doesn't restart the game, but it's an ending for the game to check the soda machine. It's like, oh, well, I guess there's no sodas for me today. Why is an art gallery set up this way anyway? Why do you have a robot slave? And a mermaid slave. I was making a joke about the robot slave, but the mermaid slave is actually a slave. Hmm. Slightly disturbing. This time I'll go for the secret ending. Alrighty, now let's time to go. For, it's let's time to go for secret ending two. Hey, so you made it. Um, what is this? This a kind of experiment. I guess that makes you the lucky volunteer. Sounds better than a test subject, doesn't it? Where am I? Well, the secret ending. Except there's no way for me to subvert the normal ending. It kind of ties it all together in the end, so instead, this kind of is an experimental ending. What happens now? Now you get the prize you jumped through hoops to get. Or I guess, walked around for. Still, I appreciate the effort. So then, your prize. When the game restarts, input the name Into the Mist. No caps, no spaces. Into the mist, right. Remember, the secret is not part of the jam. The secret is all non-jam stuff. Assets in the secret were made long before this. This is just for a bonus for winning for the, this game. Now back to the normal secret ending. Right. What if I go check this door instead? Nothing. Check this. Okay. I'll finish up the secret ending and then do what this game, what the, what the mysterious, I'm assuming the developer said? Sure, go. Alrighty. Let's have a go at it. Into the mist. This leads to a secret. This is not part of the game jam content. Continue to the extra games. Weapons can be reloaded with R. The door seems to have locked behind you. Options room. What would you like to change? What? What is going on? Into the Mist 2, the cult. Into the Mist. Load room. Huh. Janitor Jet. What? What on earth is going on? Project Mist Arena Mode. Survive for as long as possible. This mode is very unforgiving. It's a large mechanical fortune teller. It seems as though you can put in a word and get a fortune based on the word. Hello? Machine remains silent. Uh, mist. Machine slowly begins to speak. Doesn't matter what it is or what it does. It matters where it's coming from. Help. Remains silent. Right. What are you? Art Game Untitled. A short game about an art gallery. 
I'm actually gonna have to leave. I. I'm blown away by this, in fact. This has just taken a turn. I'll do the uh, short game art gallery, then I'll do Into the Mist, and then Into the Mist 2, the occult. Uh, next episode. I didn't even expect to do two episodes on this game. But yeah, this has been Minimalist Art Club, I guess. Or is it Into the Mist? Or wh whatever it is. Whatever it is, I'm going to call it Minimalist Art Club. So thank you for watching this episode of Minimalist Art Club. See ya!